Hey everybody, hope you guys are doing alright. So, um, you can make a smoothie without a blender. So most people uh, reach for the blenders when they want to make a smoothie, but you don't have to. As long as you choose soft, ripe fruit, you can mash it by hand and stir it in your favorite smoothie ingredients, uh, such as yogurt, if you want, that's what you're going to use, or peanut butter, uh, if that's what you're going to use too. Get the classic smoothie texture by shaking the mixture with ice until the smoothie is cold and foamy. Use this simple, neat method for your favorite smoothies, recipes, or create your own custom beverage. And then also just to share with you guys, like one of the reasons why I bring this up is because Pops always told me how, you know, when you're dealing with the apoptosis of the, or the, when you're dealing with the hemp roots, which cause the apoptosis, apoptosis, excuse me, um, you don't want to blend them because that kills some of the nutrients in, in the hemp roots. So it's like, ever since he told me that, I was like, okay, well, we should, you know, do things without blending them because that makes sense. The heat of the blending um, kills things. Heat kills things. So, um, but I wanted to look it up just to get the specifics on things. <clears throat> And so here we go. We got a, uh, does blending destroy nutrients? So does blending destroy nutrients? In short, maybe a small amount, but nothing to be concerned over. Now that's, I mean, it is what it is. I mean, a small amount. I mean, you know, when you're dealing with a bunch of sick people in a sick nation, you're trying to help heal people in the nations. Um, you know, that small amount could be a big amount, you know, and if there's a better way to do it, why not? However, if it is a very small amount, I don't mind using blenders and then just offering people like, you know, it might take a little bit more time, which thus means a little bit more energy and money to do it by hand is the method I just showed you. So, you know, you could have a choice. You could be like, if you want your hand, um, you know, if you want it mashed by hand, it's gonna cost a little extra because that's just, it just requires a little bit more work. Or you could use the blender, which you know, is gonna be quicker and easier, but maybe not as nutritious or apparently not as nutritious, but maybe not, you know, it's not a horrible, you know, you're not losing a ton, but you are losing some. So um, I don't know the exact specifics, but apparently according to this article, um, you do lose a little bit. And then there's also what Pops told me. So, you know, I, I'd be interested to know how much you really do lose. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to share the information with you guys. And, all right, hope you all have a good day. Love you guys. Bye.